Hi, welcome back to my channel. Um, I, I bought another piece of luggage. Alright, so let me explain. <laughs> when I went on my last trip, I actually needed to take my laptop and my iPad for work reasons. For work, work reasons. And I ended up needing to take a larger backpack. So I normally don't take um, my laptop. I just take my iPad and I go places. And because I had to do specific things, I took the, the laptop. And so I needed the bigger backpack. So the crossbody backpack that I normally use, I did not take. And because it wouldn't fit the laptop. So I ended up with all of our craziness. If you haven't seen that video, um, then I uh, needed, I had to pretty much hold stuff the whole time. So it was kind of bad um, for my shoulders. And so backpacks are not good for me. That's the reason I use the crossbody. So, what I did is when I got home, I realized that I can't be put in that predicament anymore. I really need to have something that will actually work for me in various ways. And so, I went online and I got this off Amazon. And this is what I found, which I think will work for what I need. And I can actually use this for work as well to be able to carry stuff around. Because I do um, different types of activities and stuff where I have to take things and this is a good way to like be able to haul stuff around this little like it's an underseater. <clears throat> I'm going to put the link below, but I have no affiliation. It's an Amazon product. I have no affiliation. I don't get any credit. I don't get any cash. I don't get anything. You don't get a discount. But if you like it, then and if it works for you, that's fine. Now, so I don't really know if I'd use this as a laptop bag. I would probably have to buy a laptop sleeve because it's not really made for a laptop. But I would do that if I had to take a laptop with me in the future. Um, my laptop is rather large. That's why I say it may not fit in here. Um, but <laughs> uh, an iPad definitely would. And my biggest thing is that it, this has inline wheels. So I can either roll it myself with the handle. Or... I can put it on a larger piece of luggage using this strap here. So that's what makes this good, is that I don't have to carry it. So even if I have to check my luggage and then you know you always take like a personal item on, this would be my personal item that I could take, put it underneath the seat, it would hold my iPad, it would hold some personal things, it would hold you know your little, uh, like if you, especially on a long flight, you wanna freshen up, you know, brush your teeth and stuff, so it can hold all your hygiene stuff and things like that. Even if I had a carry-on, I could put the carry-on up on top and this still could go underneath and I would still have access to all the things I need and I could just like put, if I brought a purse, I really don't take purses on cruises anymore, but if I was going somewhere else and I wanted to bring a purse, then I would just pack that in my suitcase and I would just have all my essentials in here. Um, so that would be the goal with this particular piece of luggage. So let's look at it. Um, on this side, you could probably fit like a large water bottle because it fluffs out a little bit here. So you could put a large water bottle in here. And then, um, or I don't know, whatever else that you think that you need that could be, uh, that you want to be secure. This could be where you have your documents, your wallet or whatever. Then on this side, it has a USB port hub, so you can charge your phone or whatever, depending on what your uh, power bank looks like or how big it is, you know, depending on whatever you want to charge. Anyway, so it's right here, and then there's a pocket down in here, and that's kind of nice, especially if you are charging things and you don't really want to use it at the time you're charging it, then um, you can always uh, pop it down in here. So that's what makes this nice. There is no other pocket on the back. There's just that um, handle sleeve for the um, put it on like another bag. I haven't taken any tags off yet, but I think I'll do that right now. All right. So we have um, nice handles. 
We've kind of the little Velcro thing so you can keep the handles together so not flopping all over the place. Um, there's one uh, pretty good size pocket. This would be good if you wanted to use this for your documents or wallet or whatever. Um, in this area, I mean, that would be pretty easy access or if you, you know, whatever you think that you need, like right here. This could be, I would think I'd put like my toothbrush and stuff like right here. So, and then let's see, where's the, I need a drink of water. Oh my gosh. I was out walking and then I got the notification that this was here and I was like in a sweater this morning and it got really, really hot here. And so I thought I'll come home, do this video and uh, get some water and change my shirt. I was like so hot. All right. So, we have, so this one folds out a little bit farther, which is kind of nice. I like the way, see how it kind of just has that little um, area where it just pops out. That way you can put anything. I actually think my iPad would fit in here, and I'm going to check. Oh, yeah. Oh, baby. And that's with the case. Let's see. Will it? And literally, I think the cord would fit right there if I wanted to charge it. Oh, best. Oh, yes. All right, so that would be really good for this area. And it looks like you would still have a little bit of space in there. And I have a pretty good size case here. So that is like, score! All right, so this kind of keeps things very um, organized in here. And I probably... The only thing I wish they had in here was another little sleeve pocket. So you could put like the chargers and stuff. That would have been perfect, right? Perfect. But I'm happy with this. And I could probably find something like a little pouch and put like a Velcro on it and pop it in there. What is it called? DIY, DIY, do it yourself, DIY, DIY. All right, so here we go. Now here is a smaller one. See my hand, and I don't have very big hands, but my hand doesn't go that far in. I'm thinking this may actually be pretty good for like, maybe like a little rolling charging thing that I have, which would probably fit in here, and maybe a couple pens. I don't know if documents would fit in here, but it's possible, possible, possible. I don't know. We shall see. I try to go as paperless as possible. Anytime I travel, I try to go really paperless. So usually at the airport, try to go, you know, use the phone. I try, I, I try to go as paperless as possible. I just, I just think we, I love the trees. Love the trees. All right. So here is this. And this is what I like about this. This folds all the way down. It goes all the way down. So it opens all the way up. So this is what I love. So this has, and I'm going to hold it up here so you can see. So, and this is going to be slightly, a little upside down for a little bit. Okay, okay. All right. There's one pocket inside here, which has the USB and then a little pocket to hold like your power bank or something. So right in here, I don't know if you can see it, but it's right in there. I'll take a picture and insert it. And then this part right here, it doesn't come out, which is what I was hoping for, because I thought this would really good, be good for the liquids, but it doesn't. But it does snap out. It does snap down, so you can access this area pretty easily. So. Now I've had another like hygiene case that was clear and I literally just rolled it open and they didn't have me take out a little extra bag or anything. So it's totally possible that maybe you could just zip this open and then they would be fine with that. Maybe. Okay. Um, and then there's a clear pocket here. You can see, and then there's another one here that's not clear. 
So I would think, in my mind, if I had to roll this open so they could see the liquids, then I would put, you know, some essentials here, but then maybe put like undergarments and things in this little area to hide them. <coughs> Alright. That's my thought anyway. That's my thought. Alright. Oh my gosh. I actually am just loving this little thing. Now it just doesn't, it has the inline wheels only, so it's not a four wheel. But I'm thinking that's okay. Um, it's either going to go on my suitcase or um, if I'm just rolling it, it'd be very, um, like short distances and stuff. I don't think it'd be that bad to just roll it. Uh, I have rolled it before. And I'm thinking even if it's packed and stuff, it won't be that heavy. It won't be as bad as me holding a really heavy backpack, <laughs> which kind of sucks. So in the end, I, I'm actually really liking it. Um, I don't think it'll hold my laptop unless I got a smaller one. Um, but I mean, I could see it possibly. I just have to measure and see if I'd want to do a smaller one. But at this point, I mean, I'm okay with that for now. I think it just depends on what my life and where my life takes me and if I really need um, to have a smaller laptop to put in something like this. But I'm loving it. So I thought it was a good deal for what I paid for it. Obviously, if you're going to be um, clicking on the link, um, Amazon changes prices every now and then. So if I say it's one price now, it may be set another price later. Oh, I am thirsty. So I'm really thinking this is going to do the job and I won't have any more pain and stuff rests anymore and I think it'll hold everything that I need and I love it I, the fact that I can like add this to my carry-on put the care have someone put the carry-on up on top because there's always someone that helps and then uh, this would go perfectly underneath the seat and in reading the questions on Amazon so many people were saying they'd already used theirs on like Delta American Spirit Southwest was it Southwest I think Southwest um, United um, so I plan to use this pretty soon not on a flight but I plan to use it if you have any questions leave a comment below if you like this video give it a like and don't forget to subscribe take care and have a great day